I don't want to speak from a political point of view because what, we, they came in here on a matter of change. Uh, change, change. Uh, uh, but now we are seeing budget being presented. In fact, that's almost the last working day of the senators or, the, or of the National Assembly. It's coming on the 13th. Uh, that is uh, Wednesday. The National Assembly is breaking up on Thursday. So definitely, we'll, there's nothing will be done on this, this thing for the whole of until uh, some part of next year or early next year. Uh, Nigerians will judge. We will be when some of us speak. They will say because we are in the opposition party. But Nigerians should judge whether this is what, whether what is happening now is alternative because we are very careful what we say. We want to get to a point by next year, we will not be able to put some of these things before Nigerian people to see whether really the people who claim to come in matter of change are really prepared for the, for the change they have come for. Or they just used to bamboozle Nigerians to get to what we are. What has been a start? What really, have they really implemented the budget? Nigerians should judge. What, what have, what have, what have, apart from maybe payment of salaries and all those recurrent expenditures, what have they really done in the capital budget to affect the life life of Nigerians? Nothing has been done. We're in recession, we're in this, we're in this. If you were coming and you told Nigerians that you can fix the economy of Nigeria once you come, you can fix this, you can fix this. They all were hearing that, oh, we didn't know it was this magnitude. We didn't know it was this. We didn't know it was this. So you were not really prepared. You didn't study the economic situation of the country. You didn't even project what would happen. You didn't even make yourself. If you are going to a warfare, you must be able to tag, I mean, to have an idea of what your opponent is really going to do. If I strike from this point, what, is, what will be his reaction? What is his possible, uh, possible reaction? If you are going to court as a lawyer, you must be able to anticipate the argument of your op uh, your, the op opposing camp, the other camp. What is the other, this, the other lawyer on the other side, what is he going to say? So if you are going for an idea to administer this country and you fail to anticipate the worst part of it, and then you are giving excuses, well, Nigerians should judge. But to me, I believe that no matter what anybody does, this country must move forward. As it is, the current fiscal plan of 6.08 trillion Naira is expected to end in May 2017, while the disagreement between the Senate and the Presidency with regard the 2017 to 2019 medium-term expenditure framework and fiscal strategy paper remains unresolved. The Senate claims the document is empty and unrealistic and has been returned. Constancy projects, budgetary provision bill. Some of the areas of dispute include the proposed daily crude production of 2.2 million barrels per day. Legislators say it is an unattainable dream considering the destruction of facilities by Niger Delta militants. The crude oil benchmark of $42 per barrel is also a contention as uncertainty surrounding global oil price persists. Well, the truth of the matter is that you, you, at the end of the day, the MTEF will have to be passed by us based on realistic terms. Currently, we have a, a research team that is looking at what will be the appropriate indices that we're going to use, what will even be the right benchmark in terms of pricing the oil that we are going to use, you know, so that by the time the budget comes out, we know exactly what uh, we are going to use as a basis to determine the revenue framework upon which the budget can be based. But I know that the President is anxious to get the budget presented to the National Assembly, if nothing else, to make sure that uh, he conforms with uh, the extant laws. But the only safety valve that's available now, why the economy will not be very, you know, jolted too much, is that the last budget we passed, we gave it a lifespan of 12 months, 12 calendar months. So until we pass the next budget, that one will still be running. The revenue flow has not been able to match with what we expected. You know, this budget was passed predicated on so many items, one of which included that they will have enough funds to prosecute the budget. Some of those funds, of course, majority of them was going to be based on uh, some grants and loans they expected, but up to today, 
We have not yet received any money from the places where they anticipated they were going to get funds to prosecute the budget. The Senate's Deputy Majority Leader, Baba Ibn Nala, is cautiously optimistic that the federal government is on the right track. People should understand the difference between presenting a budget before the National Assembly and considering the budget. They are two different things. And I have equally said that approval of NTEF is not a precondition for presentation of the budget, but it is a, pre it is a precondition for considering the budget. I want you to understand. And what the president is coming to do on, on Wednesday is to present the budget to the National Assembly. Now, before we go for that to consider the budget, we now have to approve the MTEM. And what is MTEM all about? MTEM is a medium term expenditure framework of the government. It's for us to know that in consideration of the budget, sufficient information has been provided to the parliament to form the basis upon which the budget is going to be funded. I want you to understand. And what is MTEP talking about? The MTEP is, is, is generally talking about the income of the, of the country, or which we refer to as revenue under the constitution, based on perceived, derived, and accrued one. And then stating the various sources that this money is coming to. So when we look at that, we will now juxtapose it with what has been presented as the spending uh, 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 proposal by the government to see whether they, they, can, they, they, they can configure themselves, you know, so that we do not promise to Nigerians what exactly uh, 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 cannot be achieved. And, and that's the whole basis. So I have not seen any reason why uh, people should get apprehensive about whether the MTEP is approved or not. The most important thing is that it is not a precondition for presentation, but it is a precondition for consideration of the budget.